When you look at a centenarian, they bring a hundred years of life with them. And so that is very different than just to see them at a hundred. It is bringing with you a hundred years of life, which makes really their perspective so unique, because it is so much longer than most people can expect to bring. Aging is, of course, a complex matter and also a product of a life that you have lived. It's a, a combination of both decline and development. Doctor, in my sick room, the Lord has been good to me. Doctor, in my sick room, the Lord been good to me. He I realize that I am older than I ever expected to be, and I realize now why I can't do a lot of the things that I thought if I ever got back into my house I was going to do them. Now I can't do anything because I got to hold on to something with both hands. So. Uh, too often we believe that uh, age is the cause for any behavior in late life. It is because you are old that your health is failing. It is because you are old that you might be lonely. It is because you are old that you're not doing this or you're not doing that. My name is Wilfred E. Miller. I was born in Pittsburgh, PA on November 22nd, 1905. If I make it to November, I'll be under two. <laughs> there I go. Do you feel like you're 102 years old? I've never been really aware of my age. I, I did things. It was never a problem. I've never been a warrior. I, I've had a lot of things to worry about. If you can do something about it, do it. And then let it go. Don't live with it. I mean, I can't. I can't do it. There are certain types of personality, certain types of stress and coping mechanisms that they use over the lifespan. And then because, perhaps, because of those personalities, that they were successful. Now, I'm getting to where I cannot see like I did before. As I say, you all, to me, are just shattered. But uh, I, I don't think about it. I go ahead and take it as it is. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you can't fix it, forget it. Don't worry about it. People, this day and time, they take too much medicine. They're always taking medicine. And I do not take medicine. I do not have a doctor. Didn't your husband sometimes try to give you some medicine? <laughs> no, he would say, I sell it, I don't take it. <laughs> there are many aspects of aging. Of course, you age by the years, but you also age by function. And one way of measuring aging is, of course, the way you function, both in a physical sense, but also in a psychological and mental or even social meaning. So, so aging can be measured in different ways.